what's going on guys she's getting undressed and then like redressed by nat she's like zipping my zipper down so you can get the little logo for the t-shirts so that's cool i like it though you know we do have we do have t-shirts you'll be able to find a link in the description box below if you're you know you're into that kind of thing helps support the channel a little bit appreciate that um so today is uh thursday february 10th we're mm -hmm. running kind of behind for the week um as we took monday off and so um we're just kind of getting into it right now today's gonna be our deadlift day we're rocking a deficit deadlift so that'll be the main the main movement for the day and so we're gonna integrate my man tommy who's over here uh, <laughs> into the deal he's excited right you said you wanted a deadlift yeah. although it's not you know a straight <clears throat> uh, normal deadlift i still think that you'll find that it's uh it's some, some good times and we can we can play with the deficit too so that's something to think about for you guys is deficit just means a deficit it doesn't necessarily describe the exact distance so you can play with some distances then too right like maybe you maybe you stand on only like 10 pound plates and just get that you know half an inch to an inch maybe you stand on a 100 pound plate and get like that that two inches whatever so you can play a little bit of a, a little bit of variety on the on the distance there so just food for thought so we're going to do that today as the main the main effort we already went for a run, which is pretty cool. Um, I kept it a little bit slower today than I have on some other days, uh, but we've added a little bit more distance in now. Uh, and so that uh, distance, essentially we added another block onto the loop. And uh, today finished the run in four minutes and 30 seconds. Um, and four minutes and 38 seconds of running may not sound like a whole lot. And you know, in the grand scheme of things, point in fact, it's not but it is, it, it is representative, representative of more for me. Um, and so that's the thing that I want you guys to think about. And that's one of the things that I'm like trying to impart into Tommy um, is understanding, you know, the idea of growth and adding, adding on slowly over time um, that maybe even if you're not necessarily where you want to be, you know, moving in the general direction is a, is a step in the right direction. Um, so, you know, I, I'm proud of my run. And I don't mind, I don't mind, uh, you know, laying it out there for everyone to, to hear. I'm not embarrassed of it because I know that it will, it will add up and add up and add up. And then sooner or later I'm running, you know, a much longer distance, you know, miles, two miles and whatever. Um, but you got, you got to start somewhere. So I'm happy with that. That felt pretty good. And the thing for me that I was most pleased with is be, being able to get my heart rate and my breathing back under control pretty quickly to the point where I'm not huffing and puffing. So... I'm trying to make that a concerted effort with my kind of cool down uh, when I finish up the, the, the run as well. Um, for our winning warm up today, we're gonna do some reverse hyper. So that is like posterior chain, throw that in. We're gonna do some adduction. Um, so working on the kind of the inside of the groin for that hip stabilization. Uh, we're working some pull downs with a little bit wider grip. Uh, so just some variety for the, the pull downs. Tommy's been working on doing some pull ups so this type of, uh, of an exercise will help out with the back um, and help improve, you know, kind of pull up capacity. And then we're gonna round it out with some leg curls, which has become Tommy's favorite in such a short period of time. Tommy was just, just yesterday, he was talking about how much he loves doing curls. And he said, he said to me, you know, I was really astonished. He said to me, Brad, you know, I don't, I don't even care what day it is. We need to throw in curls, leg curls. Yeah. And I was like, you know, Tommy, it doesn't really make a lot of sense for bench days. And he's like, I don't care, Brad. I want to do leg curls. That's how this also happened. Yeah, yeah. Because Nat loves this. So So the only thing that we could have done to make, make the day better really is add in the sled. Fuck no. <laughs> I would leave. <laughs> so we got some reverse, cur reverse hyper. <laughs> <laughs> some leg curls and some sled work oh, all on the same day. I think Matt would disagree. I think that's I think that's really Nat's recipe for uh, uh, Nirvana. That's that's like Nirvana for for Nat. Matt Winning would disapprove. Reaching reaching enlightenment for Nat. That's it. Reaching right there. enlightenment of anger and ball. <laughs> enlightenment of this fury <laughs> that you're gonna release. Pilot light lit ignite. <laughs> Um, yeah, okay, so yeah, that's the deal. That's what we're doing and kind of what we've done so far. Um, I think with that, we'll actually be able to close up the garage so Tommy can stop shivering. It's weird, we bring him in the house, we feed him some hot wings, he and he shivers. shivers. We go outside, he sh I think he's just a shiverer. Shivery. He's not, not, it's not chivalry, it's, it's shiver, shivery, shivery. Shivery. Yeah, anyway, 
Uh, so that's the deal. So hopefully you guys will stick around and check this one out. And hopefully we'll get through it and have a good time and do some deadlifting with Tommy. He says he's excited now. We'll see how excited he is later. All right, uh, with that being said, let's get after it. And I'll see you on the other side. Here we go. <laughs> Looking like a grudge over here. That's it. That's the video. Tommy, come on over here for a second here, man. I know you're playing on your phone. Totally disinterested with what's going on. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, explain how you're feeling. Explain what's going on. I'm just hurting. <laughs> my, my area right here. <laughs> his groin. His groin. Groin. Yeah, his, uh, his adductor is bothering him, right? Inside? Mm -hmm. You know, medial? Yeah. All right. So yeah, that, that adductor is bugging him a little bit. We uh, we went for the run. We even threw adductors into uh, the the running warm up. Um, but some of his motor pattern, how he was moving as he was coming down, as he was standing on that block, he was really just trying to do this, kind of bowing those legs out to get himself down more. And uh, I I think that that kind of irritated the uh, the muscle. So. Um, Worked a little bit of mechanics and just talking about not bowing those knees out and then, uh, you know, trying to keep that chest up, right? Mm -hmm. And then we did a little bit of light work uh, with keeping that chest a little bit more more upright. How'd that feel? Honestly, a, a lot different. Yeah. Just, yeah, just fundamentals. I need to work on a lot on deadlifts. Yeah, and so it's something I said to Tommy kind of mid-stroke through the workout. I was like, yeah, I mean, we had to work on your form and your, and your mechanics. And he kind of said like, oh. And there was like this hint of disappointment in his voice, but but realistically hasn't spent that much time um, working out and training and, and trying to be serious and moving like decent weight. 
Um, so it stands to reason that he wouldn't be that fluent at it. The same way that like I can't speak Chinese, right? Haven't spent a whole lot of time doing it. So uh, that's pretty much that's pretty much how that goes. You get, you know, what you focus on, you find. And so we're just gonna spend some more time and energy, kind of focus on the form and stuff. And I, I may be, I may actually even purposely uh, kind of kind of govern him from going too heavy, um, just so that we can explicitly work on some of these mechanics, kind of ingrain these motor patterns, and then sort of kind of waving back up for him. So. We'll see how that goes, and you know, you guys can kind of be able to continue to check along with his uh, progress as uh, as we go through time and space. So, um, pretty good. You got up to remember what you got up to? Two seventy five was pretty brutal, right? Two seventy five, yeah. So moved up to two seventy five. Uh, gave that a whirl. Nat two fifteen got up to two fifteen, which was good for her. I think step in the right direction. Uh, in fact, I think his PR over last time, yeah. I think so. I think I think you're in PR territory because you rep 225, which is what you had a hard time doing last time, and you you made it easier this time. So even was if, it 223? Mm -hmm, yeah. Oh. So even if it wasn't even if it wasn't necessarily a weight PR, it certainly was like a motor pattern PR. Like you moved it easier this time than yeah. than the previous time. Um, so that's good. And then um, I got up to 500. Uh, I had a little bit more in the tank, but. Uh, you know, it's it's already kind of late. It's it's after eight o'clock. It's time to start getting kids ready for bed and uh, moving into kind of the next next day. And speaking of getting ready to move into bed, I got my man over here waiting in the wing. Come here, come here, man. Yeah. You help you help me do this. Uh, you help me do this outro. Yeah. Okay, cool. So, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. I, I only run half of the last part. All right. Well, then here, Nat will help us out here. Nat, can we, can we see can we see his jacks here? All right. So remember, no matter what it is you think you can't do. You got to get in. Train to spike. And train to spike. Oh, I only do the end. Oh, okay. All right. Well, then we'll, we'll we'll try it over one more time. All right. The boy, myself, Tommy, Nat. I want to thank you guys <laughs> for your continued support, for uh, you know making the channel what it is, and we appreciate you. Uh, if you have any comments, questions, concerns, leave them in the chat box below. We'll really respond. And uh, remember, no matter what it is you think you can't do, Bye. like work on some mechanics and uh, you know develop develop your form. So you can be more betterist. It's never gonna happen if you don't get in train spite. You're either gonna find an excuse. Or you're gonna find a way. And I'm not mentals. <laughs> and I hope that you guys continue to find the way. And we do. We hope you continue to find the way. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys. We'll see you in the next one. Peace. Peace. Peace! Legend